Earlier, Mike and Ian talked about the cracked rails and the track problems because of the cold. Well, school buses in Fairfax County especially were affected by the cold this morning. The county school system reported more than a dozen schools were affected by late bus runs, all blamed on the weather. And as Jeanette Reyes reports, some routes were as much as an hour behind schedule with kids shivering outside. Well, this morning we experienced some of the coldest temperatures so far this winter, and hundreds of students with Fairfax County School District were waiting outside for up to an hour on delayed school buses. The district decided to remain open and on time today, which already infuriated thousands of students and parents. But to make matters worse, the school later sent out a tweet alerting parents on a 30 to 60 minute delay for buses running through Herndon, South Lakes, and Marshall. Pyramid neighborhoods. The hashtag close FCPS trending worldwide. Many saying that some students on free or reduced lunches cannot afford jackets or coats to stay warm outside in these frigid temperatures and may not have alternate transportation. This is the second time the district has gotten serious backlash over decisions not to close or delay school start times. The first was back in January. One parent says it's hard for people to forgive and forget. Can't say as I'm surprised. Everybody spun up from earlier in the year. So they're going to stay spun until people realize that, unfortunately, weather is less predictable than it used to be. It's a situation that's unfortunate. We certainly apologize if any students, um, you know, were waiting uh, longer than normal for a bus this morning. And a spokesperson for Fairfax County Schools says they were made aware of engine problems on those school buses close to 7 o'clock this morning. This is the first day back to school for those students since last Friday. Reporting in Fairfax County, Jeanette Reyes, News Channel 8.